Now we're going to review simplifying rational expressions. I need to simplify this. To simplify this, I need to find the factors that will give me my denominator. So I must factor this. So I need to think of two numbers that multiply to give me negative 8, but would add up to a positive 2. Two numbers that multiply to give me negative 8, but add up to a positive 2. Hmm. So I do believe that would be a positive 4 and a negative 2. This trinomial factors to x plus 4 and x minus 2. Now that I've factored this, I'm going to draw a line lightly through it. Now that this is factored, I can also look for my excluded values, values that cannot be. Well, whenever you have a fraction, you are not allowed to have a zero in the denominator. So to find my excluded values for the domain, I take both parentheses and set it equal to zero. and I solve them. Now, finding these excluded values occurs before you simplify the problem. When I look at this problem up here, I see that I still have, I have common factors. I have the sum of x plus 4 on top, and the sum of x plus 4 times the sum of x and negative 2 on the bottom. So if I have a common factor, I can cancel them out. When you cancel everything, you're left with a 1, and on the bottom I have my x minus 2. 1 and x minus 2. These excluded values um, give me other information. But to find the excluded values, I will set the denominator, I will factor it, and then set each factor equal to zero and solve. This is simplifying a rational expression and finding excluded values.